Discipline and character, absolutely. Um, I think humility is a key leadership principle. I, I think I read a white paper at Fort Benning a long, long, long time ago called The Willingness to Sacrifice, and it was all about shared adversity uh, with your soldiers. I think that's a key attribute of leadership. Um, innovation, uh, if you'd asked me three years ago, I would say I'm the most non-innovative person in the United States Army. Um, ISTJ, every time I take a Myers-Briggs test, it tells me the same thing. ISTJ, um, and I think you heard this part because you laugh, but, but I am a Gemini, so maybe I've got two sides. Um, so the I think I've learned to be innovative, but, you know, and I, I just – Last, last week, uh, 38 years in the Army. So the, the Army has a way of molding your thinking. So I would, it, it, this may surprise you, I would not call myself a wildly outside-the-box innovative thinker. That's just not the way that I've been brought up in the Army for 38 years. I, I try hard, uh, but what I think I do do well is surround myself with people that don't necessarily think like I do, and then the willingness to listen. And I think that's another key leadership attribute is even when you think you know the right answer, the willing to listen to other people's uh, opinions on things and other ways of doing, uh, getting at the answer. And I had a division commander when I took Gray Wolf up at, uh, at Fort Hood that told me, if it's not illegal, immoral, unethical, or unsafe, it's just another course of action, right? So the willingness to listen to people and try things that may be outside your comfort level. And then I think the other key at the key thing leaders do is, is push all the credit on the people that work for them and then stand up and accept responsibility for the things that don't go so well. And, and, you know, one thing I did, we did a robotics uh, experiment up at Fort Carson is willingness to fail. Our soldiers don't like to fail at anything. And, and sometimes the whole point of the experiment is to push it till it fails. Um, and so the willingness to, to fail early, learn from it, and then, and then implement and move on uh, to a better solution. I mean, I, 38 years, I've never, I mean, I'm sure I failed at some things, but overall, I don't think I failed at too many things. Um, but just the willingness to, to fail. Uh, and then learn from it and move on. And that's that whole men value prototyping, soldier touch points that we kind of talked about.